So everyone, everyone is trying to see if they can eat a whole Chipotle bowl in under seven bites or in seven bites. And that is crazy. Your contribution to society has been well received. Why are y'all making this a trend? Why is this a trend? Why is this a thing? Why were you fascinated by somebody who's a big 500 pounds? Someone who is mortably averse. Okay? You are being inspired by them yeah. to what? Try and see if you can eat a whole Chipotle bowl in under, like, in, in seven bites. This is the USA. If there is one thing that we don't need, it's to try to see if we can eat a whole Chipotle bowl in, in seven bites. We, we have won already when it comes to obesity. We don't need to try and see how much of a big back or obese we can get. You know what I mean? Like, what is up? Now, for all the fat activists, um, 500 pounders out there, is this your people's? Is this what you want to promote to the world? Is this you? Is this you? What do you think? Huh? What do you think? Because when you see someone who is 500 pounds on the internet promoting a rush -a -cha, that's you're okay with it. That's what you want. That's what you want. You're cool with that. That's good, right? Okay. I I truly believe that every extreme is bad. Promoting extreme uh dieting bad. Promoting excess eating also equally just as bad. Let's go ahead and watch this woman scarf down. Can I eat my Chipotle bowl in under 10 bites at 500 pounds? I think she knows she can. Like, th this is a trick question because she knows she can. Rhetorical question because she knows she can. There's no point trying to answer the question because she knows she can. She probably done it a couple of times now. Don't pretend. Don't be acting on you. What do you mean? Let's see. You know. You already know you've done it five, six, seven times when the camera wasn't on. You just decided to turn on the camera. That was it. Stop lying. Let's see. We don't need to see. You have seen the future already. Okay. Now that's a big spoon. Okay. That is a cooking spoon. That's the kind of spoon that you use to make a big pot of soup or a big pot of something. That is not an eating spoon. You have promoted people out there to go and buy spoons for cooking specifically to try this challenge. I don't know if this is a marketing scheme, but it's working. Did she just hop in excitement? <laughs> she can't wait. She cannot wait. Look at the way her tongue was. <sighs> That's her daddy right there. <laughs> That's her, that is her man. She can't wait to dig in. You know she's been here before. One. Girl, don't pretend you need to blow on it. Your, your, your taste buds, your tongue, your heat receptors are probably burned off by now. <laughs> Let's give it a book. gotta pray <laughs> god thank you for this food may you bless this food that is going against your own laws in the bible about bless. <sighs> yeah two here's the thing right this is a new to her like she's eating you know these huge scoops of chipotle and she's like rejoicing she's not going oh oh my gosh Okay, one more. Let's do this. I can do this. She's not doing that. She's just a, mm, mm. like, girl, you're not struggling. You're not struggling at hey, all. Where's the challenge? The Doritos on the counter actually kind of annoys me. I hate it when people put like food on the counter and then like eat it. Like, to me, the counter is dirty. You know what I mean? Like, I hate when people do that. Like, you be watching them cooking videos, and they, they get the meat, and they put it on the counter bare. I just want to mangle you. Oh, my gosh. Three. Look at her mouth. Four. 
for? She's not struggling at all. Basically, feed her content. And I think there's a difference because other people who are like trying to do this trend that aren't that aren't of uh, you know five hundred pounds, they're like, I'm I'm, I'm gonna try it. You know, I feel a bit, there's a little bit of a struggle there. But for her, her tummy and her throat and her mouth, they're all wide open. Just mm, mm, more, please. Mm, 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 mm. No struggle. I don't see no sign of resistance. She's even clapping. Like, <laughs> five. Five. Sounds of victory. Six. Six. That was indeed six bites. That wasn't really seven. That wasn't really seven. Cause all that stuff that fell down could have been on that not not on that spoon for the sixth bite. It just sadly fell down. That was all that happened. That was no bit like she could have said, "Can I eat this entire Chipotle bowl in seven bites with a drink on the side and some chips?" Because that's all she did. She ate that with chips, so she has a lot of room for all of that. That's crazy. And then the speed. How long did you think this took her to eat? <laughs> Where you go? Okay, you gonna eat that too? Might as well get some fiber in. Still hungry, she says. Still hungry, she says. Isn't that wild? Isn't that crazy? Why isn't this alarming people? Why who? Why would you see this and be like, I am inspired? So at this point, she is influencing people. This is her influencing people. Is this what you want, Mrs. M Mr. Fat Activist? You want to influence people to be just like you, to be big bash, just like you, to be unhealthy? And to eat excess amount of amounts of food, we're this is America, okay? We're not new to this. Like you don't need to prove anything. We already know. We got the numbers. We got the stats. We got the trophies. Stop. And now you have other people trying to see if they could they can eat a whole Chipotle bowl in under seven bites. I saw a girl eat a Chipotle bowl in seven bites, and I've literally been losing sleep over this because I think my big back self can do this easily. So let's get to it, man. Of course, we gotta add Bye. the sides. Also, I'm going to take it a step further and I'm going to use no Bev because as you guys know, I ain't never need a Bev. All right, let's get into the it. The Big Back Olympics. Now we got people out here eating with ladles. Great. Needs more dressing. This is three bites, and I might be able to do this in five. I've never not enjoyed a Chipotle bowl so much. Now he's promoting that he's enjoying a Chipotle bowl so much. What? It makes no sense. First of all, why would you even say that? You're trying to tell me that because you're eating with a whole ladle, somehow you're enjoying the bowl more than regular times? Look at, look at his... Look at his face. That is just so like uncomfortable. Like imagine you walk into Chipotle and you see people just sitting there. <laughs> oh, they all got like ladles and stuff. Like, <laughs> like whoa, whoa. I'm scared. <laughs> like every time he goes, he was like, like his. I was actually fucking late. I think it's safe to say we completed it in five. Does this count for a six bite? Because that's like all that's left, but fuck it. Throw this in. 
Light work! I don't know if that's something I should be proud about, <laughs> to be honest. I now nominate myself as the president of the Big Back community. Five bites Chipotle bowl. Let me know the next challenge. This is fucking light. See you guys. This is promoting obesity. Let me know the next challenge. What if the next challenge is, oh, let's, let's see if you can eat a whole box of pizza in, in, in like, in like, I don't know, three bites or something. Like, do you see how this is problematic? Do you see how this is toxic? This woman is promoting her obesity and her obesity habits. And then motherfuckers are like, oh, let me see if I can do that. Okay, cool. And then tomorrow you want to come on and cry. Like, I just gave I just bite it so hard to like eat in the deficit and lose weight. Mm -hmm. Now that's what I'm talking about. People are being influenced by this. This is very scary. No, because it's getting out of hand now. Is anybody worth Isn't it a challenge to be like, yeah, if you can do it, I'm going to give you something. You're now trying to reward big back behaviors, unhealthy habits. Y'all crazy. Where is the common sense when you need it? Where is the logic? This has to be the most reasonable video I've seen throughout all of this, honestly, because that's a good thing to reason. Just stay trying to figure it out, and hopefully you don't ever figure it out. Hello, I'm going to redo the Chipotle Bowl Challenge, and I bought this other spoon. Yesterday I did it, and I... Why would you want to redo it? So, because of this challenge, is your second time trying to do something that's unhealthy? Why so much effort and money and time being spent? Right, virality. I failed and I concluded after much disappointment that it was a spoon I was using. It was this thick ladle thing. Sriracha just because I can't. Barbecue sauce. I'm still gonna apply the same rule where one spoonful is one bite. Bite number one. Everyone that's doing this, like their face is like, like their eyes look like they're about to pop out of their freaking skull. And I can see the struggle, you know what I mean? Like this is just so uncomfortable. It's just kind of hurting me just watching it. Solid first bite. I can fit more in my mouth. Okay, bite number two. Can you fit this dick? <laughs> I can do even bigger. We're making good pace right now. Bite number three. Oh, dude, these past few times they've loaded me up. I swear, it never, it's never happened. Promoting indigestion. Let's go! By number four. Like this is really promoting big back activities because I you also you're also using your hand and the ladle to support. It's like, yeah, let's get in there. Coo, coo. Gotta guide the food in. Mm, the difference is I'm like really able to like you know, the spoon is thinner on the bottom. Okay, bite five. We're trying to give you guys a good shot of this. That's not even a spoon. Ooh. Did y'all see the eye twitch? I think I think some some was like being activated. His stomach is like it's like capacity is full. Alright, we got it. Bite six. I think get all the rest of these toppings on this thing. Okay, last bite. Perfect bite. Done. Ready? Uh choo choo. Mm. Sweet redemption. Seven bites. Let's go. Man. That feels good. All right. Well, that, I did that in seven, seven bites. So comment below if you want to see me do it. But I shovel it. And my mouth capacity is one bite. I guess. Bye. Thank you guys for watching. You were proud of yourself. That's crazy. You want to. You're like, oh, you want to see more of this? You want to see more of this? That's how it starts. If you want me to do something else, just, just, just comment it below. And I'll do it. I'll do it. I'll, I'll continue to force feed or to overfeed, overindulge, overconsume, and participate in them big back activities that leads to obs obesity. Obesity. Promoting obesity. That's crazy. That lady who ate the Chipotle bowl in seven bites is objectively gross, but I can't even judge her because the speed at which I eat my bowls, 10 minutes and it's gone like that. Yeah, but you're eating them in smaller bites so you're giving your body more time to like take it in and digest the food right
eating in under 10 minutes still not healthy but it's definitely better than eating huge chunks of food okay like you're probably not chewing the whole thing what indigestion hello hello is that you future problems at this point you might as well just have a medical doctor as standby you think you can do that i don't know if i can do it in four but i know i can do it in five okay he think he can get his chipotle bowl in five bites so we'll see if he eats in five if he eats the chipotle bowl in five bites i'll buy that uh playstation five. First bite <laughs> see how he can't even get his mouth around like and maybe the other guy had the right idea about changing the kind of ladle you're not gonna be able to <laughs> that's like two that's like two damn boy damn I can't what watch this in the bowl for He's struggling. He's struggling. I agree. Oh my God. He said you need a break to be on some. And he's taking a break. Like that first lady, she <laughs> that was routine for her. She said, I'm done and still hungry. I don't know if I can watch you eat like this. Hmm? I don't think I could I can watch you eat like this. Okay. Ugh. Uh, so uncomfortable. Red Bull gives you wings. Gotta get all the energy to shovel in some food. Last bite. That's the sixth one. So he didn't do five, but he's gonna try to do six. Mm mm mm. From the biggest bite. And she, <laughs> I think she used the ch the chips as a chaser. Red Bull's my. Red Bull's your tracer? Okay. Red Bull gives you wings. Okay. <laughs> Not sponsored. Not sponsored. Oh, what the fuck? Ooh, I know your back hurt. I just know your back fucking hurt. Jesus. Ooh. Baby. Baby. Can you eat me out like a Chipotle pop? Oh, I can't watch this. Get out of my face. You got, you got like TikTok influencers doing this. This was a video that actually triggered me to actually like pay attention to this trend. Cause when I first like heard, like saw like a couple of the videos, you know, about, oh my gosh, I can't believe she ate it on the six bites, da 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 da. I went to Chipotle because I saw this woman eat, you know, whatever in seven bites, da 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 da. -da. I'm like, skip, <laughs> you know, cause I'm thinking, what? No, I'm not trying to indulge in that. It wasn't until an actual TikToker that I follow made this freaking, I was like, hope. Hi guys, so today I'm gonna be trying to eat my Chipotle in seven bites. Like this is my first time ever eating Chipotle. And let's see if I could do it. I'm gonna use this spoon that we usually use to cook. If you're okay, so. Exactly, used to cook. Wait, let me. This thing tastes like mayo. Oh my god. I can't do it. Guys, I'm not gonna give up. I'm just gonna finish it. Like, I'm gonna finish it. It's not even like the bowl is small, you know what I mean?
like you can tell she's struggling look at the way she's breathing bro she's like <laughs> girl like she's struggling for real she got to take a break she got to breathe again ever yes please don't please don't i know she, you know what i trust her i trust you girl just don't do it please you can see like her like most people like their version of a bite it's so different from the first woman because her bite was literally literally a bite right let me see first bite <laughs> Her bite is literally like a bite, and she goes, so she sucks it in like a vacuum. She goes, slurping it in. That's how, that's how she gets it in. So if y'all gonna do it, at least watch her or something and figure out how she be doing it. This is what we're promoting. This is what we are promoting. Wow. And then she ends it up with a fan. I'm about to be in the bathroom all day tomorrow. <laughs> not normal it's not normal then this video also pissed me off when i saw that an african woman an african woman was doing this challenge but with not ch the, the chipotle bowl because they probably don't have chipotle in their area you know she she does it with fufu and soup i was angered by this because why is this this trend going that far why is it going that far why <laughs> ah That is a huge, huge fufu swallow. That's gonna be so uncomfortable down the throat. Oh my god. Oh, you know her head game strong. Oof. She's like, I can finish this entire fufu in seven, seven bites. There's barely any soup on that. This moment that he knew, he fucked up. Oh. Ah. oh oof gosh i just oh gosh no mm -mm. Mm -mm. you know that's just gotta hurt i don't know she she did not finish that video but with that video i wouldn't be surprised if other african people start to do the challenge with african food and swallow and i'm just like please 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 god no why is this what is trending why is this trending can it can it stop trending the video really pissed me off because i'm like y'all really got to this african woman but anyway that's it for the video go ahead and like subscribe share leave a comment Mwah. cheers tomorrow y'all gonna come on the internet and be like fat shaming you're fat shaming us ah let us just promote a city of peace and just be a peace and peace and get rewarded for it